Hello and welcome back to more Pokemon Leaf Green Post Commentary Let's Play. I still need to think of a better name for that. I think I say that every goddamn time. Anyway, starting off by going into the uh, Pokemon Research Lab. I think that's what it's called. I didn't actually read the sign. There's so many, there's so much to do, so much to see, so what, so come with me at the back street. I don't know the name, of that, I don't know how that song goes. This guy will give you an electrode if you trade him a Raichu. This bitch will give you a Tangela if you trade him a Venom. But as you already know, Tangela is in that route up the way, so you don't need to, why, why, why trade one when you can just go catch one? Just literally a few shuffling feet up the way. Which, you know, that's not, that's a trade I'm not going to do. This guy will give you, the, oh, this guy will teach you a move, I'm sure you know about it, Metronome. What's that Metronome right here? And this guy talks about how Eevee can, don't play that song, that car's pretty good. Uh, that guy will tell you about Eevee could evolve it a different Pokemon. This guy will actually trade you a heal for a Ponyta. But you can actually catch heal, heal, heal later, so never mind. This guy, this is the guy you want to talk to. He's got a fossil restoration machine. Remember the fossils we got earlier? This is what he basically uses to restore those fossils to Pokemon. So I start off with giving him the Helix fossil. And here's what you do. You have, the Helix fossil. you have to leave the room. And then go back in. That's all you have to do to get it to work. He'll basically just say leave and go for a walk. And in case you're late, even though you literally just took one step at the fucking door. Well, he's put it in, but I said done. Where the fuck is this going? And now give me another fossil, which is the um, old amber. I don't know. If I don't think there's any other way to get the other fossil, the dome fossil, which is probably why they have two versions of the game. Dome bottle. I don't. If you, I hope you don't hear that in the background. I don't want to get sued. Give him the old amber. And restoring from that, okay, once again, I'm, I'm apparently late. Is that the like, part you were saying? Oh, hold on. That's right, that's right. He gave us Aerodactyl. Now, do I show these Pokemon off? <laughs> I actually forgot to. I don't show them off until I'm, until I'm returning them to the PC. So I actually show off this Pokemon Center visit just so I can put these Pokemon in the PC so I can get two Pokemon back out. Can I put two Pokemon in the PC? You see what I'm doing? Okay, so that, look at that full box. Wow. I'm taking Jolty on back out the PC, and there's and there's Omanite. The Omanite Helix fossil. He's a water and rock type. And bringing out back Charizard. There's Aerodactyl, a rock and flying. Aerodactyl is one of the fastest Pokemon in the game, and he hits hard. Omanite, he's actually a defensive water type. His typing doesn't really do well for him. And this generation because of the special 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 player. But now we go to the Pokemon Mansion! The Pokemon Me! Which is because my, my mate calls me Mansion. So he's only. Is he still call you that now? Huh? Is he still call you that? He doesn't call me anymore. Was that Andrew? That was Andrew. <laughs> I put a, I put a pill up because there's only one wild Pokemon to catch in here, which I decide not to go for. Now, I stopped, there was a, there was a nice hesitation there, which I, I don't know if it'll show it again. I got an escape rope in case you want to go out there, but you might notice something. There was a slight hesitation that I managed to edit out, you might not actually see it because I stopped for a minute, but apparently there was Pokemon higher leveled than Lapras, so the repels weren't really working. So I decided to send somebody in that was just over that level, I was encountering level 36 rackets, so I decided to switch Primate up the front because at least then I won't actually encounter anything. This is a very interesting place because I go around and just looking for stuff and then you'll see these diaries. Which I won't get yet. First of all, there's, there's trainers in here, but this is a completely... Alright, just be an asshole to me then. <laughs> I was going to say this is a completely unique trainer class. But it's no, instead of being an asshole. What are you watching? I'm just saying it's fucking. So I'm currently waiting to turn Fallout 76 Jeffrey came out for GameStop and they offered them $3.95 pack. And. Oh, okay. Yeah, you We can watch this later. Jesus Christ! Get 
God damn! That's why people play games so because apparently there's a turning place, things like that, fish. Honestly, all returning prices are kind of shit. Especially if you paid like £50 for a game, considering Jesus Christ, those price increases for games these days are freaking atrocious. Yeah. And, pe people and then pe if you return it the next day, you can get it for like yeah. 9 tenths of the original price. Yeah. And, and what's funny, people back then made it all to NES, he's watching game prices, and fuck me, that's quite a lot. And then look at them now, like, fuck, that's still quite a lot. Hey, if you, ha if you, if you, have, to, if you have to try and bra buy, like, bry. If you have to buy like a brand new NES game, you'll probably find that I'm off the ton of position. These, I think, I don't know what these statues actually are, but press a switch and the eyes turn on. You press these switches so that you can actually open up these gates because you can't really progress unless you open up these gates. What the fuck did you click on there? Oh, no, I had a propel run out of Ah, okay. That's a good thing about the new Pokemon games, the automatic easter option to put Yeah, a that button. makes it so much better. Oh, I wonder if we've got that in Let's Go's. And I got a pro- I don't know how repels work in Let's Go. No, I think the Pokemon just run away from you. <laughs> they like, oh fuck, run. <laughs> okay, I've just oh. been cautious to circle in the exact same area, even though I don't need to go out much further. But, up the stairs we go. You take a nice throw. This is the unique, the new unique trainer class that you only find in here. Ladies and gentlemen, meet the Burglar class. Oh, I was going to say my, my Burglar class. Arnie. Hey! You better not be using my Charmander as a freaking robber. Charmander. Hey, I've been watching Tom Fox play, well, let's go, and he keeps calling it Charmander. <laughs> At least I'm glad to know I'm not the only first that calls it that. Chummy, chummy, chummy! It doesn't really work with Chameleon. Chameleon! Chameleon! <laughs> chummy, Chameleon! Can. Can. It, it's actually. Gandu. And, and I'm gonna bleep that out. I'll probably forget. <laughs> Did you bleep out for the drink and support? Uh, yeah, you've seen that fucking three times. It's my fault, I've got fucking shit memory. I can't remember if I locked the door three steps away from you walking away from it. Then how the hell could you remember everything you're doing in a game when you're 100% it? You remembered, you remembered every route to take in Ratchet and Clank to 100% it. Because I'm a gamer, I remember things it's important. <laughs> I had a hat in time! Did I 100% platinum in time? You got all the time pieces, you. Yeah. Did I 100% platinum in time? Because that works. Look at this, look at this diary. We recently discovered a new Pokemon, Mew. This mansion! It's actually more interesting than you think. You don't find the legendary Pokemon here, but one was created here. Because she's under, because she's under the van. And if I don't yeah. say it, I'm not going to say it because a new Pokemon was discovered deep in the jungle. That's them talking about how they discovered Mew. Mew was the first mythical Pokemon discovered. You're probably thinking, oh boy, when do we get Mew? You don't. It's literally impossible to get Mew. There's the picture of the Red Gigas that I was talking about. The Red Gigas. God damn. That looks pretty fun, cool. Should we go up these stairs and I think... Okay, I get the item first. Max Potion. You got a lot of minerals in here. Yeah. Tell me I get the diary first. God damn it. I want to go to the goddamn diorama. The, the, the diorogy. Let's go to it now. Today. Ninetales. Look. Ninetales, what you think about it, is actually in, I think... Some ancient mythology. I don't know what kind of mythology, I just know it's ancient mythology since Ninetales, that's kind of what Naruto's special that's kind of what Naruto's special ability is. Like, like a nine-tailed fox. Yeah. Yeah. I don't watch Naruto, so don't question on me. And Andy's probably headbutting his desk right now watching this because he loves Naruto. He, he'll hear you say that and he'll be like, What a great, what a great! <laughs> this, this, you gave birth. I mean, the, the newborn creation was named Mewtwo. So yes, a legendary Pokemon was it discovered. Thomas, a legendary Pokemon you can't find in here. But this is the place Mewtwo was created. This is why it's fucking burned down to fuck. It's an abandoned mansion. If you watch, if you watch the fucking Pokemon film. Maybe yeah, like not the one with Genesis yet, because fuck that film. I know. Okay. Why is Mewtwo a woman? I think they're a drug voice out that died, that's why. You mentioned... Ninetales, don't you? The origin thing? Yeah, sure. Ninetales are ba is based on a fox, particularly the Kitsune of Japanese legend, which have many tales, extremely long lifespans, and can breathe fire. 
After living a long time, kits can take on spirit forms, which may explain why Ninetales can learn ghost type moves in particular. Ninetales is based on the Japanese reign. A kitsune of advanced age, whose fur has turned silver gold, and upon gaining its ninth tail, has gained powers equivalent to a deity bearing omnipotence and omnipresence and omni omniscience. Then all the nine tails seem to have faced on the Arctic fox. There you go. The seven deities. I don't know if that makes sense. It makes my fucking ghost view hot, but Okay, so that's why it's kind of it's in Naruto. Eh, Snow Lass gets his first crack at stuff. Why am I sending him against Magneton? Because he's got a brick breaker. You still got yawn on him? I keep yawn on him, can I need that? I'll need that for legendary Pokemon. Have you got a po have you got a Pokemon that can you just pulse swipe? Uh no. Okay. Grant, see by the time I get to the legendary Pokemon, I'm probably gonna be the same level as them anyway. Is red in this game? No. Yes, no. I am red! Do you fight yourself in this game? Yes, no. No. And this is the first usage of sh no, no, I don't think it is. This is I hate when I get paralysed all the time. I forgot that happened. But you're, probably, you're probably thinking, why give Shadow Ball Snorlax? Ghost type moves are physical. Snorlax has a decent physical attack to it, so Shadow Ball kind of works on him. Can you see? You can he's see more bulky. He, he, he's, my, he's my bulky team member, but he can, he can actually deliver a hit. You can see free plays for you, that poor fucking Pokemon Showdown online shit, can you? What? You can save replays for your Pokemon Showdown online. Save replays, yeah? Yes. I don't know. So it's going to say, we can do that. You you look at stats of your whole fucking team, take that on thingy, I'll, and I'll just copy the exact same and so have face off each against each other. Like, here you go, you're facing red. I, I <laughs> need to have red as my sprite then. Now, this is the bit I can never figure out. You have to fall down one of these holes, and I fell down the wrong one. Fuck so, on. Let's try that again. <laughs> You're like, fuck that. <laughs> I didn't fall. Fuck, he I don't get it. They're kind of at the same level. But yeah, if you fall down the other one, apparently you wind up a different area that's nowhere near the, 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 the other hole. I'm like, how the hell did I even work? How the hell did I even work? Magic. This is the hole you have to fall down. Electrode. I think this is the first introduction of Electrode. But it's a faster fall turbo. And it's just even more lazy because you just turn it upside down and give him a frowny face. And you want to know why he smiles you? Because he's just looking at you, knowing I'm going to explode on you and I'm going to like it. I'm going to fuck your shit up. Send Titanic back out because he's probably sending a fire type out. And he sends out wheezing. Oh, wheezing. Ah, oh, yeah, because physical defense, so he should die to psychic. Wheezing. Which is what I say every time Lapras is out there. But Lapras can't one shot anything to save his fucking life. What's the stats in this lap? Like oh, it's, a, it's, actually a de it's actually a defensive Pokemon as opposed to an offensive one. Is it shit natures? I've never actually paid attention to the natures. Oh, yeah. I think I, th I think it's so important. I did, I, I, at one point I was going to look at my natures, but I completely forgot about What's it. What's that, 31? So 31. 31. Oh, and there nice. you go, it learned a move I was wanting it to learn, Ice Beam, so now I take Body Slam off it, and pretty much, she wants to learn, I, I said Body Slam off it. Look at 95 power. Why the fuck does this sound confusing? Oh, I keep confused with you on it, just enough chance I want to fucking be an arsehole. Fair enough. And here's you, the thing. You confuse them they, they don't hurt themselves. <laughs> like, oh yeah, that happens <laughs> every time I play. I hit myself every turn, they get every shot out. So, so that move shit Lapras has, get used to it. It stays that way the rest of the game. I'm saying that now, it stays that way the rest of the game. I don't change the, Lapras' move shit. up the carbs. Is that a cut there? I don't know. Downstairs. That honestly, when I first played this, I could never figure out how to go through this place. I never knew how to get down here. Because I could never get into the gym. Because in here, you find a key. Don't know why I'm doing it. There. In quotes, but it's actually what I want before. Awesome powers. Some people don't know how this works. Laser. Uh, you need to find a secret key to actually get into the gym because Blaine, partly one of his puzzles. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I like Blaine. Which is probably explains why a lot of. Uh, is he the current in the Pokemon card that's born and looks like a fucking Steam card for his nose? He looks like Dr. Robot. He looks like fucking Gerald Robot if he's going to Adventure 2. Yeah. Okay, continue. I don't know why his model looks like that. And yet you look at his anime model and it's completely different. Okay, but let me see. I think... 
because of Blaine's gym. That's why a lot of the po a lot of the trailers in here actually have a eh, eh kind of Pokemon. <laughs> Screw it. Blaine is fire type Pokemon. That's why I'm trying to train up Lapras. Lapras is, I'm going to take Lapras through Blaine's gym, and he uses fire type Pokemon. So it's kind of funny that most of most of the trainers in this mansion actually have a Mewtwo is far too powerful. We have failed to comprehend it. No, I screw up here. I should have went to the left because there is an item there, but I do go back for it. But I can't remember what it is. And knowing my luck, every time a repel runs out, you take one step and you get an encounter. It hasn't happened yet, but I've been lucky for it to not happen. Getting get comfy there. I think this is the last trainer. Send it out a Magnemite. You know, you want to do Pokemon Start for the channel? Okay then, be good at them. I am good at it. Do some Pokemon that will be hard to get, like fucking getting Mag Magikarp, Hansel, and fucking Nightmare. Are you gonna try and go? Are you gonna try and go for an every Pokemon run? That's doable. Yeah, the only reason I'm saying that is because you, you don't need to get every Pokemon to finish the game. I know. I don't have any Pokemon that could be fun. Do you remember the secret issue? The secrets in the game? The secret Pokemon? No, well, no, some of the secrets you have to do in that game to get to the area issue. Do you remember the secret issue? Do you know, the, do you know, do you know some of the like, special condition Pokemon? Like, involving Pikachu? The one people who make them follow the apples on the surfboard, so he has the surfboard right in the Pikachu picture. You've also got Pikachu on a stump. You've got hitting Charmeleon and the fucking lava pill for Charizard to appear. You need a bit, you need a bit of good angle for that because Charizard is way big. Yeah, the same, you, all, you, all, you, you do the same for a beat though. It's the same with fucking getting. It's either Zapdos or Moltres to spawn for their, for their eggs. Thing. Yeah, you need to get one of the last. You need to get one of the. Well, Moltres one is easy, but you need to get one. You need to get an item for like to I think spawn Articuno and um Zapdos. You need to get electrode. TM twenty two for solar beam. I don't teach them to. You need to get electrode to go up to a wall for you to go through that secret part to advance through. Yeah, sure. Yeah, we've been uh, just. I went. do roughly know what I'm doing. Yeah, because you kind of knew everything. You kind of knew everything you were doing in Poke Park when you, when you, when you, when you played that. You just didn't get. A, you never got every Pokemon. You never best friend everyone. At this rate, we will probably no bother going back to. It. There's no point best friend though because it doesn't gear. Yeah, I know. Full restore, that's what the item was. But we got our secret key, and you may have noticed I encountered a wild Pokemon about like 30 seconds ago. I only kept that in for one reason. I didn't realise I was going to find a Pokemon that strong. And I realised I can't get out. I could have used an escape rope here. But for some reason I decided not to, and I go back down to hit that switch. Just so I can go out that just so I can go out that door. By the way, see, even though we came downstairs, that door can still technically take you back outside the mansion because it's one of those ooh, creepy puzzle mansions. But we have our secret key. We can now access the gym. So you we are going to be getting out of the mansion. Uh, so we will see you guys. Okay, I thought we were going to do that. Next time, we will I take just... on the gym. See you guys in the next one.